Good evening, everyone. I hope you're having a fantastic start to your weekend. It is Friday night, and Tina and I are at Scream Hollow, which is a scare park in Smithville, Texas. Uh, they have five haunted houses. Four. Four haunted. Oh, there was five. I don't know, but the truck over there says four. Five haunted. I saw five on the thing, but it says four on the truck over here. So it's probably four or five. How about that? <laughs> Uh, we are headed in. We're excited that you're here with us. We're gonna check out all the sights and sounds. Let's get in here. You can see the Scream Hollow truck says four haunted houses, but I read online it was five. And as you walk in, it is a castle. You have the ability to be able to buy tickets here. All kinds of good stuff. Don't bring your weapons here. So tickets tonight cost $32.50. Um, she is getting a scaredy cat necklace, which means they won't jump at her or touch her or any of that good stuff. So me, I'm not going to get a scaredy cat necklace. I am going to let them have their way with me. And as you walk in, you can see there's skeletons everywhere. Lots of scary skeletons. Looney Tunes, Looney Bins, and yeah. Yeah. whatever else, and whatever that thing is, that Russian woman. Gotcha. Then you got the mansion, coven, <laughs> all witches, and stuff like that. Gotcha. Wicked Darkness over there. Der. And uh, I got my Vidia going. Anyways, <laughs> Wicked Darkness is a pure black attraction. It's like a sensory move it type stuff. And then over here, right next to the bar and everything, we have the Haunted Hayride. Gotcha. These two open last, but these three will open first. Gotcha. Due to darkness being a large variable in the haunt. Gotcha, gotcha. Smells like KFC She's calling it, he's calling her a chicken. Don't worry, you won't be the only one. And it makes you feel any better, big boy done jump twice. The cool thing about this place is everyone's really nice. It's not like scary, scary. Uh, they're actually kind of nice and they kind of tease you and play with you, which is really cool. So um, that's kind of the reason why we like to come out here. <laughs> jump it, jump it. Tell me you like a little snarl on the back of your neck. So how much did you pay for that? One dollar. One dollar to have everyone stay six feet away from you. So they cannot scream in her ear. Oh my God, I can't handle it. She hates being screamed at. <laughs> Even though this place is called Scream Hollow, she hates being screamed at. I don't want to be screamed at. She might be at the wrong place. <laughs> and they are observing social distancing out here. You can see, please allow social distancing between groups for the comfort of those around you. Alrighty, we are going into our first house. I cannot record inside these. It says exit only there. Is that, is that legit? Entrance. Entrance. Okay, here we go. I'm not going to record Go get when I get in there. Thank you. We are going to walk in here though and show you right up to the point of where we enter. There is a creepy, creepy clown. So in we go. Got some high voltage stuff going on here. Looks like someone getting shot. Not entered yet. Almost in. Is this Endridge here? There is a scary clown, and this is the slaughterhouse. In we go. Oh. <laughs> There's the entrance. But you're all are holding hands. That defeats the purpose. Alrighty, so we did the slaughterhouse. Super fun. It's really long. Yeah, it's, it's a lot longer than it was last year. It seems like it's it's bigger than it was last year. Super fun though. Yeah. Good act actors. Scare actors are great. Yeah, they're not like scary, scary. I mean, if they jump out maybe at you, they're scary. Maybe because of my scaredy chain. Yeah, maybe maybe they're being a little kind to Which us. Which I appreciate. Yeah, but they they're awesome. They're funny. Yeah. Uh, they jump out at, at certain times. Uh, the homeboy over there, he couldn't start his chainsaw up. Looks like he's got someone he's chasing here now. 
but with us, he couldn't start his chainsaw up. So uh, I think we lucked out with the noise there. Yeah. Next up, I think we're gonna do the asylum. And let's get in here. Social distancing, the, all the warning signs. And then insane asylum is this way. Really cool, like really well themed. So here's, this is the Lost Pines Asylum. And you can see it's pretty <laughs> spooky. And, Don't get it. yeah, yeah, he kind of scared us. Oh my goodness, look at this. She's kind of scary. Yes, we're ready for you. Oh, look at this, look at this. Oh, around we go. <laughs> Again, the theming in that other one was awesome. There were a lot of clowns in there. There was uh, the uh, the slaughterhouse. There was body parts everywhere. It was really cool. See, so you kind of wind around here in this fence area. And in we go. Oh yeah, there used to be a girl here. And she's not here anymore. Oh, there she is. Hi. Hello. Hi. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're fixing to go in. So, Asylum, really cool. Really, great. They got some really, really great every one of these is like longer than they've ever been. They have bodies in, in there everywhere. <laughs> They have cages with decaying bodies in there. There's probably three or four different um, scare actors in there. All in all though, great, really well themed. I probably like this one better than the first one, um, just, just because of the theming in there. Definitely, if you come, that's if you're only gonna pay for one or two of these, definitely wanna do that one, Asylum for sure. So a Coke and a water cost 433, so not outrageous by any stretch of imagination. Uh, we're just taking a, little intermission here before we go back into i don't know what's the next one uh, i took a picture of it it is wicked darkness oh mansion of terror i think we haven't done so that. the next one is mansion of terror sounds scary <laughs> this guy right here is the best dude here he walks around just laughing the whole time whatever they're paying him is not enough <laughs> So now we're going into the Mansion of Terror, Kevin. Go around. Oh, where do you come out? Yeah. Alrighty, so in we go. Pretty exciting. You can hear in the background the whole time they have uh, live music going on. Just kind of cool too. Alrighty, we made it up here. Here is a view of the the mansion. It doesn't look much like a mansion. It is scary though. Oh yeah, skeleton got right there in the window. Yeah, that's really cool. Again, the rules, no running, no phone lights, no photos, no food, no touch. Do, do not touch the props. Do not touch the monsters. And in they go. I really wish I could take you guys in to these places because they're so cool. I don't know what that is. It looks like a clown nose. Is that where the baby is? Yeah. But I don't know what's in that mailbox. And that is a rather um, ominous number. 666.
already the mansion was unfreaking believable. The theming in there was incredible. I've never really ever been scared in one of those before, and they got me a couple times. And it really started with the actress. I mean, the, yeah, the scare at the front door. She did it. Yes, she she had this story uh, about how she uh, murdered some children, and cut their hearts out. Well, there's a lot more to the story. I just gave you a little bit. It's pretty freaking it's awesome. cool though. It's awesome. The theming in there, it's like a it's like an old mansion. It's it, it, it reminded me of something that you would see like at Disney, the theming. I know granted they're 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 um, not scary. No, it's not it's not scary like that. But the uh, just all the stuff they had, like um, uh, the the, Don't give it away. the chairs and the candelabras and everything that they had in there was incredible. That's that's a really neat one. All right, we got two more to go. And we're going to knock these down. There's a hayride coming that's supposed to be a quarter of a mile long. So we're excited to do that one. Let's do it. Alrighty, up next is the dark. This one is pitch black. There is no, cannot see anything. It is called Wicked Darkness. Six feet. Six feet, yeah, yep. They got to stay six feet. Good job. She's wearing her, she is wearing her, her necklace. It's a no-no square. Yes. no-no square. So in we go. <laughs> That's true. That's true. Alrighty, so we're going in this one. This one, if I remember right, it's just blackness. This is so hard to navigate through, but we're gonna do it though. We're gonna get through it. We'll get through it together. Look how scary she is. Ooh. I mean, she's beautiful, yeah, my bad. So out of all the ones, the Wicked Darkness one was probably my least favorite. Uh, it was still fun, but if there's just not a lot in there, it's just darkness. Oh, there was, jump scares. Yeah, there's jump scares, and then there was like a, a spider in there. Beware of the spider. He, he kind of got me a little bit. Uh, but that one's shorter than the other ones, uh, but it's still a lot of fun, man. All of these have been awesome. So we have one more left. That's the Hayride, and that one's supposed to be really good. So let's do it. So what is this again? This is the museum. Oh, very nice. Wow. This is so really this, cool. This is just a gift shop. The museum is actually two additional buildings. Okay. So right here there is a Halloween timeline that is 6,000 years. Oh, wow. In the making. Wow. 6,000 years of, of Halloween. How it came to be, how it started, how oh, it wow. That is really now. cool. It's so cool. Yeah. So if yes. you guys want to go through Super fun. The only the only part that we ask you not to take a picture of is the actual timeline itself. Got it. You know because it took us really for sure. Long. No, that's awesome. For sure. To make it. But yes. Everything else. Is it an extra cost to go through? It is. It, it's nine dollars a person. Okay. Cool. Yeah. yeah. All right. It's fun. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you so yeah, much. Yeah. The haunted artifacts. Okay. Oh, so we might bring some ghosts home with us. Okay. <laughs> they're pretty. They're happy here. <laughs> yeah, we'll leave them here. Halloween. Thank you so much. Yeah. yeah so this is the only. Halloween. Oh, okay, oh we yeah. need the tickets. Oh, we're gonna have to yeah, keep these. Oh, wow. Thank grand you. opening tickets. Yeah. Thank so you so cute. much. Got so, this is the Halloween Museum. It's the Texas Halloween History Museum. Reserves the right to refuse service, blah, blah, blah. And then it says she, the lady up there was saying there's actually haunted pos uh, possessions in here. So, uh, this is pretty, pretty freaky. Look at this. Wow. How cool is this? The late case of the body identified as that of author Fox. Condemned. The Pearl Inn, Texas sofa table from lobby. Stuffed toys, children's stuffed toys left in trunks and attics, boxes thrown away, sad and no longer loved, most likely haunted. Metal nightstand from Danvers Lunatic Asylum. This is an actual casket. Child's coffin. That's kind of freaky. Rocking chairs are always scary, along with baby carriages.
I love you. I love you. Look at the babies. That's freaky. And then all these freaky toys. All of these have a history to them. The Donner family dolls. Who is Buddy? Wow. The inside of the female reproductive system. Oh God. Yeah. There's a look inside the female reproductive system. That is frightening. There's there's doctor stuff. Oh baby, look, Brooke Army Medical Center. Weren't you in the oh, gown? Oh yeah. <laughs> I wasn't in the gown. Oh maybe I was. All right. I was at Brooke Army Medical Center. Mamsie. Look, it says That's... the ghost of my old Mamsie still roam US Army South Headquarters. How interesting. Lots of anatomy, anatomy stuff on the wall. Another busted up rocking chair. Or that's actually a wheelchair. Those are the braces, my mom said I needed, I used to have when I was a kid. Oh God. Yeah, that's Maybe they were your old braces, Tina. No, I was a little baby, don't do me. Oh, you, everyone, everyone knows a Ouija board is not good. Glowing ghost glass. Uranium glass, also known as Vaseline glass due to its color. It's a glass that has uranium added to the mixture during the molten period when color is added. Due to the presence of uranium oxide in the glass, the glass will glow bright green color when put under a black light. This is the way to it, best way to identify it. So this is another building inside the Halloween Museum. Oops. I think so. So this is a pretty cool little area. There's another building to the Halloween Museum. So here is a wicker man. And the lady at the front desk said she created this. And it took her days to do it. Her and her son did it. But look how cool he is. Look at all of the freaky mask. No, that's not freaky. That's well, that one's freaky. Got Bugs Bunny. They got Mickey Mouse, Mickey and Minnie. I don't know what, he's a werewolf? Yeah, the werewolf of London. It's kind of cool. Are you Jacob? Tina is saying that is Jacob. Team Edward. But I don't think so. The Halloween Museum has a Halloween choo choo train going around. That is really cute. All right, here we go, y'all. Hell on Wheels. It's our last one. This one closes at 11.30, so we got time. And look at the build up to this. It's got its own little story here. By means of it goes on all fours. Don't know what that means. Kind of cool though. So in we go. Every one of these has got a long queue line. I remember last year when we came, it was really busy here. And I think we've kind of lucked out today because there has not been a lot of people here. I would imagine probably on a Saturday though, or it's probably much busier. You know, high school football is going on right now in Texas. So and it's that, October 1st. yeah, and it's October 1st. So it's just, you know, just beginning. But uh, I'm kind of glad we came when we did because uh, we've been able to walk pretty much onto all these. This one's actually, the queue's really long. So I, I imagine they're expecting a lot of people have done this twice now where I've hit the button and I've talked for like five minutes Whatever. and nothing comes out. So <laughs> so this time I actually hit the button, I see what's ticking up there. So anyway, that what a great time tonight was. Uh, we did the hayride. It was absolutely awesome. Um, you actually go through there. There's scare actors there. Uh, lots of strobe lights. Um, scary, uh, like things jump out at you. There's actually a whole story to it. Unfortunately, the, the, uh, the, the lady that was actually talking on the microphone 
uh, we could not hear them. So, so the story is probably pretty cool if you have that that also. But yeah, for sure. For thirty two dollars, that was absolutely awesome. And look at that. <laughs> there you go, finishing the night off. Finishing the night off. Uh, for thirty two fifty, great fun. Yeah, awesome time. I hope you guys like this video. Uh, please hit the subscribe button. Give it a big thumbs up. Uh, we love you guys. We'll see you next time. Live problem free.